so welcome back please click and subscribe to me so you can keep up to date with everything this look today is a dramatic brown eye look with a pop of pink to begin I am going to prime my face with the Rimmel Stay Matte Primer I'm getting to the end of the tube as you can see Taking my Chi Chi Fabulous and Flawless Foundation, I am dotting it all along my face and I'm trying to move my hair out of my face to then go on and dab it all in. Make sure to get up near your hairline as well. Using the 3-in-1 concealer from Chi Chi, I'm struggling to get it out of the box and also struggling to open the lid. I assure you I'm not really this weak normally. I'm applying this under my eyes on my T section of my face and also any imperfections that I have. I'm blending it in with my flat foundation brush. Make sure you bring it all down in your neck so it blends nicely. Taking my Ooh Up brow from Astralis, I'm filling in my brows with the darkest shade on there at the moment. I'm just slightly filling it in and bringing it out to a point. Taking my Stay Matte powder, I'm just, you know, buffing it in on my face. I really do enjoy this powder, it's very, very good. I'm taking the lightest shade on the eyebrow palette and filling in and highlighting my brow bone, just to give a bit more dimension. Taking my sticky tape, I am putting a piece along my eyelid just here starting from the corner of my eye going up towards me my eyebrow. I'll be using two Chi Chi palettes for this look today. I'll be using the Smokies palette and the Rich Gems palette. I begin by first applying white all over my lid. Then taking this darker colour, I'm going to start blending out my wing. I begin to shape the way that I'd like the eyeshadow to go. I'm putting a bit along the crease as well of the top of my eyelid. Make sure you blend the colours, it is very important. Taking this dark colour, I'm going to dab it on the very crease of the sticky tape and of my eye. Now it's time for the Rich Gems palette. Using this orange colour, I'm dabbing it right in the centre of my eye and yeah, it's just to give that really nice brown and orangey copper feel. Using this maroon colour, I choose to make even more dimensions to the colour making it a bit darker again. Using the white, I am placing it on the very inner corners of my eye to really brighten it up. Taking my black liquid liner from Designer Brands, I am filling in the whole top lid and winging it out. And I've stuffed up, but that is okay. <laughs> we will fix it later. Moving on, taking my Rich Gems palette, I'm going to do the bottom waterline and bottom lash line in this pink. I'm also going to fill it in with this dark blacky brown colour as well, just on the outer parts, making it nice and smoky. It is now time to fix the mistakes. Then just take a Q-tip and wipe it away. I don't know if you saw that, but my crayon just broke as I opened the lid. 
really bad timing. I'm using this to line my waterline. I'm mainly lining the outside of the eye and with my white pencil I then line the inside of my eye. Taking L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara and dropping my mirror. <laughs> I'm putting it on my eyelashes, doing a fair few coats to make it really stand out. I would not be applying false lashes in this look, but you're more than welcome to if you are making it a bit more dramatic. And there's the eyes. To once again fix any mistakes that you have made and tidy up any fallout from the eyeshadows, I'm using the concealer. Setting that with some powder and then going in with my mosaic palette from Chi Chi doing my blush. I'm using this highlighter, it's really really good, I'll link it down below for you. I really enjoy it, I'm highlighting on top of my cheekbones, down my nose and my cupid bow. Now time for the lips, I'm taking Chi Chi's crayon and lining my lips. This is Chi Chi's Paparazzi Princess Lipstick. It is absolutely phenomenal. I really love it. I'm going to use this as my base. Hello, my darling. What's happening? <laughs> and now I get interrupted by my dog, Lily. After lots of hugs and kisses, I'm going to proceed. Applying my next Chi Chi lipstick. This lipstick is ridiculously pink, so I'm going to use it because I love pink. And the final look is done. There you are. I hope you like it and try it out. Let me know what other looks that you'd like for me to do for you and what you want to see so I know. Please subscribe to me, hope you have a wonderful day, and I shall see you all in my next video. See you later! Hairstyle number two is one of my personal favourites. It's using a flower crown and lots of little flowers. This is a messy bun floral hair tutorial.